And no matter what the storm may bring I'm fine with you And the point of it all I love you Hey guys! So as you can probably tell by the title We have decided to start cloth diapering And... Excuse me There are two reasons why we didn't cloth diaper whenever Isabella was a newborn. One being we do not have a washer and dryer inside of our apartment. And two being I didn't know that there were so many different ways to cloth diaper. Um, so let's talk about one. We don't have a washer and dryer inside of our apartment and we have like washer and dryers for our apartment complex but it's like a dollar twenty five a load to wash and then a dollar twenty five to dry so the amount of money that I would be spending on washing the diapers like every so like every two days would be the same amount of money that I'd be spending on um, will be actually more than the amount of money that I'd be spending on um, a bag of diapers or a box of diapers because I'd be spending two fifty every two days. So that's that's one reason. And then you know the second reason, um, like like I said, I didn't know there was different ways to do it. Like I thought that like whenever you say cloth diapering, to me I just think of basically like in my head what I picture picture is. Um, a baby wrapped in some white cloth with safety pins. I didn't know that there was a such thing as a... Are you talking to me? I didn't know there was a such thing as a all-in-one or an all-in-two or a pocket diaper or, you know, the pre -fold. Like, I didn't know there was all this cool stuff. So, I... What are you doing? I came across it one day on YouTube and I just started learning about it and I really liked it. I mean it's caught it saves me so much money. I, I think I spend like the brand of diapers that Isabella gets is like five dollars a bag. And I think I go through about three or four bags a month. Maybe more. I don't really know. It's just like a rough guess. I have no clue. Um and now that she's getting up, up in size, she is like they they want you to pay more for less diapers. Like the the further you get up in size, they want you to pay more for less. Um, like whenever she was a newborn, I was buying fifty for five dollars, and then now that she's in size three, well she's really in size two, but I just went ahead and moved her up to size three because that's. What I had, and I didn't have any twos left. Um, she, like, they want, they wanted uh, five dollars for, I want to say like forty. Like, why would I still? Why would I be paying the same price but getting less diapers? That doesn't make any sense to me. So, I talked to my mom about it, and I decided that this is what I wanted to do. And I'm starting off, and some people might say, "Well, that's dumb. You should just start off which way you, the way you want to do it." But I'm starting off the most simplest way of cloth diapering, and that's the pre-fold with the cover. And um, I'm doing this all cost-friendly because the fact that this is supposed to save me money. It's not supposed to cost me a whole lot, you know. So I'm starting off the easiest way, and once I get used to this whole thing and figure out if I want to do this, actually, then I'm going to go ahead and get better stuff. Like, right now... I just went and bought some pre-folds, and I bought, bought some plastic underwear, like, the, the, my mom calls them plastic panties, they're like training, training pants, training underwear, I guess, I don't know, they're like plastic bloomer type things, and that's the way that we're doing it right now, but... I plan on, if I do continue, which I so far I really like it, so I plan on doing the all-in-ones whenever I get the money to go out and, and buy the fabric because I'm going to make these myself in order to save money because it just seems so much easier because then I can personalize it, do whatever I want to it, and I don't have to worry about, like, you know, all this stuff going wrong and I know exactly what, the, what everything is, but, so... The washing and drying 
part of this whole thing. Um, I did not know that you could hand wash cloth diapers, and I know that might sound kind of dumb, but seeing how, I know like you can hand wash your clothes, but seeing how like this is going up against your baby's butt, you know, that seems more of, more of like a, a sanitary thing. But I, like I said, I did a lot of research and I found out that you, I can wash them in the bathtub and with a plunger, like not one that we use in the toilet obviously, but a plunger with holes drilled in it and that'll get all of the like the poop and the pee and stuff out of the diaper which is really great because you know it's just gonna save me a lot of money and it might be a little time consuming but it's worth it I mean I really like doing it, it makes me feel kinda like close to the earth and stuff because I'm not really a uh, eco-friendly but you know like I feel like I'm doing the, the best thing you know um, I am, will wash her cloth diapers every two days, and uh, I'm trying to think. I'm, I covered the washing. Oh, the drying thing, I'm just going to hang them up to dry, let them hang up. Um, I'm going to keep them inside just because the apartment complex I live in is, it's an okay neighborhood, but uh, I don't want nobody to my stuff, so I um, will leave them inside, but put them where the sun's hitting them. But, um, I'm just rambling now, so let me go ahead and show you guys what my, what I'm using right now, but I'll show you guys the all-in-ones that I'm getting here soon, whenever I get them. Um, I am using, I do pre-folds with clothes pins, well not clothes pins, safety pins, and then I'll show you guys the, the plastic panties. So, this is a safety pin that I have, it's by Sassy, I think that's what it's called. It's has this plastic cap on it right here so that means that it will never come undone and it says it's rust proof and it says on the package is, is it won't come undone so that's what I'm going off of I don't know if it's ever going to come undone but hopefully it doesn't so it's it's white it has like this little notch in it see it um then the plastic panties they look like this. They're plastic. They're from Gerber. You can find them. I don't, my Walmart doesn't carry them, but Walmart does carry them. And then my pre-fold, sorry I hit my tripod. My pre-fold, my pre-fold looks like this. It's also Gerber. It's like the thicker one. It's like pre- I don't know. There's like two different ones and this just seemed thicker so I got this one. I don't know what the difference is. but um, So like I said, I will update you guys on everything that we decide to do with cloth diapering. But wish me luck and I hope that it, it works for us. And if it's working for you, then good luck. Or not good luck. Congratulations. But anyways, I will talk to you guys later. Bye.